This video is going to show you how to splice the backup camera for your Sylvania roadside mirror into the hot wire on your reverse light so that the rear camera turns on automatically when you put your car in reverse. The first thing you need to do is to get access to the wires that lead up to your reverse light bulb. This is typically done in one of two ways. You can either take the housing out here, like we show in this vehicle, or in your car there may be a panel behind the housing where you can access the bulb itself and consequently the wires that lead to the bulb. Engage the parking brake. Turn your vehicle to the on position. You don't need to turn your engine on, just to the on position. And then put your vehicle in reverse. And this should light up your reverse light bulb. The next thing to do is to test with your multimeter which wire is the hot wire. So put one lead into the wire, another lead onto the ground of your vehicle, and if you're getting voltage, it should be about 12, 12.8, something like that, then you know that wire is the hot wire. Strip away any excess weather stripping uh, that's in the way and go ahead and use your connector to connect into the hot wire. And this is what you're going to connect the hot wire on the reverse light with the wire coming off of the backup camera. And then this is how the Savannah roadside mirror knows to turn the backup camera on when reverse gear is engaged because it senses that there's voltage going to that reverse light. So now that we have the clamp in place, go ahead and squeeze it all the way in and the clamp should be in place for both wires at this point. And then go ahead and flip the tab over the top and squeeze that in place until it locks. And for good measure, go ahead and tape up this connection with some electrical tape. So now that you have the wire splice, go ahead and put everything back together. If you took the bulb assembly out like we did here, put that back in place. If you had to take the taillight housing out like we did, uh, go ahead and put that back in place. If there's a panel that you had to remove to get access to the rear of the bulb, uh, go ahead and put that panel back in place and make sure everything's buttoned up nice and tight. So that's pretty much it. As you can see, this is an extra step and not required for the Sylvania roadside mirror system to work but it makes everything much more convenient when your camera turns on as soon as you put your car in reverse, and we strongly encourage you to do this on your vehicle.